Hello, today I'm going to show you how to make this cool photo effect. So it's called uh, double exposure. Uh, so you could make something like this on some cameras and uh, also you can make in like Paint.net. To get started uh, you will need two pictures. One for shape like dog, uh, human's head or something. Better from the side not from the front or back. And something what you want to keep in the background. So. Something like this, uh, maybe some of the city, that should work fine. To get started, just erase background. Uh, to do that, you could just use last select tool, draw around very roughly. Go to edit invert selection, hit delete on your keyboard and erase uh, what's left. So brush with very big or ve very low, if your image is very small and hardness not very high, just on low also. Uh, maybe more and just do like this you don't have to be very accurate with this uh, it doesn't have to be very perfect uh, because it's just for shape you know so yeah I have already got a uh, cropped out image if you don't want to spend your time you just want to apply the effect you could just download this image from the description below and to make the effect add a new layer move it down and we will add some nice background. Click more from the white color increase this uh, yellow thing by a bit so you'll have this hex code or something near that. Choose gradient tool, uh, radial mode and draw from center to side and you will have something like this. It's not nothing fancy, it's just uh, to be aware, okay? And go to top layer and take your second image which you want to apply as a background thing uh, go to edit, select all, copy that go to your image, uh, edit, paste into a new layer if it will prompt you to expand canvas or not just keep it as it is and if you want you can just place it somewhere and deselect now, change this layer blending mode to lighten click OK or maybe uh, additive would, would work or overlay some one of those three and go to the second layer uh, which is your shape thing going on go to adjustments, curves uh, play around with curves till you get something very good you, ca you could just uh, draw that one point to the bottom right corner or you can just play curvy stuff like this as I did so yeah that when you are satisfied click OK image flatten and you are done that's the effect if you want you can just uh, I don't know add feather on the edges but if you done erasing thing right with uh, not very high hardness you should get something very good and I hope you like this uh, hope Hope you will make something awesome. Uh, I would like to see some results in Pinot group. Thanks for watching and I see you next time. Bye.